Hello everyone, my name is Jerry Bjorn, and welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet. So last time we had defeated Larry, the normal type gym leader, and this time we are on our way to the False Dragon Titan. And this... Arvin, I think, is that his name? He wanted us to face three of them. Three... Three, not three, five of them, and we have defeated four. So we are very close to defeating the fifth one. Make it across here. Okay. So we're in a new area so we can get a new Pokemon. What is this pink thing? Is that like a fish? Tatsugiri. Huh. Alright, so we have to battle it. It's stronger than I was hoping it would be. Did 32 damage, okay. Does terrestrializing increase my stats? Or does it just like change my typing? Do a couple more. I want to try to put him to sleep before before switching or anything. Man, I was so close. I could have one of those Swablu. Actually, actually, I guess I'm fine with this if, as long as I can catch him. Because this thing could turn into something cool. Wow, fuck. That was also my strongest Pokemon. Shit. Uh, that fairy attack was doing some good damage, so... Big Pig? Muddy water. What the fuck? I don't really have any good Pokemon for water. I guess electric, but. So he. I don't want Yeastmon to do it, but he's the only one who's. He's the only one. What is this? Shit. One, two. Please. Please. Yes. I can't believe I've lost two Pokemon to this thing. What the hell? Oh, it's a water dragon. This is a small dragon Pokemon. It lives inside the mouth of Don Dozo to protect itself from enemies on the outside. What do I even name that? I don't even. 
even know what I want to name it. I'm so mad at this thing. No. What symbols do I have? I can't use an at. Oh. All right. Well, an and's kind of. This is my damn dragon. No. Dread. Dread Dragon. I guess I can put a space here. No, he's coming on the team. Oh, and he's not gonna listen to me. Shit, because of his level. Alright, so... Put away held item. Put away held item. Alright. You know, I just had a thought. If he's level 54 and killed me, maybe I don't want to keep going this path. Maybe I should head the other way. Uh, Tropica seems like a good replacement. Alright, I don't really have any items to give other than rare candy and the ones that I've got returned to me hmm. actually I'll give eh he's probably quick enough is there something that makes a Pokemon more friendly some good moves for either my air slash that's a good I get whirlwind No, Trailblaze? I think whatever. He did no some attack. That was grass. So maybe it'll be fine. Yeah, he does. Magic Leaf, 60, and it never misses. Okay. Alright. Oh, I could have had a Vaporeon. Alright, so maybe to keep going that way is bad. But... Every time this map, it rotates this map, I get so lost. Yeah, the Psychic Gym should be fine. Because I think these were only like level in their 30s. So. Will you heal my Pokemon? One of them got really beat up. I'm curious. I'm guessing if I love, can level him up like one level, he's gonna evolve. Oh shoot, I 
forgot to change my target. Set that as destination. What kind of moves does he know? Oh yeah, what is muddy water? It's, oh, it's, I mean it's a good attack. It's nothing. It's nothing over the top of crazy, but. Any good um water water pulse? Man, eh, kind of weak. Bullet seed, really weak. Dragon tail, huh? My dragon can't learn it. my leader Pokemon? Oh yeah, yeast one. That should be fine. Oh, that does not do much damage. Just do a normal bite. Oh, that was so close. Oh no, he's confused. Shit, now I really have to catch him. No, he's gonna hurt himself in his confusion. Don't. Don't do it, Larvitar. Hurt me. Don't attack. Yes. No! I... If you hurt yourself, I'm gonna have two failures in this episode. Three failures. Oh, Stone Edge is gonna hurt. Oh, there's an Umbreon in the back. Come on, stay in this one. Please. Yes. Ah, too bad I can't. There's no one on my team I could switch him out for. They're all newer Pokemon. Born deep underground, this Pokemon becomes a pupa after eating enough dirt to make a mountain. Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna call him dirty pupa because he eats dirt 
and the word poopa makes me laugh. Go do some damage. Sick. Uh, make this one my main. Is that smart? see your future. Let's see if you'll make it out of this cave. Because I feel like as a scientist, he probably... they mostly have steel or electric. Yeah, electrode. about sending my fire ghost Pokemon to face anyone in this cave. So we'll be weak to the fires and the ghosts. I think something happened. <laughs> This, did it say mud shock does not affect him? All right, try to freeze him. I guess. All right, hopefully another ice will freeze him. You'll be fine wherever you go. Thanks. It's fine. All right, get me out of this cave. I hate it here. Man, I'm glad I got these super jumps. Alright, so the gym seems to be above me. Should be fine. Oh, I've never faced the Luxray. I guess just mud shot them. Mm. 
get his speed down low. So he does 36 damage in attack. Mm. Oh. Interesting of you to use Roar. Okay, that is not better for him. are about to give out. I'm about to give up. Yeah, well, I'm still pissed about losing two of my Pokemon. I think this is going to be the way out of here. I'll tell you why I'm so worried about the weather. Hiker Daniela. said earlier, ice is not effective against rock, so it is effective against ground. Right? I mean, I guess if he's not doing any damage, that's fine. Shit. Okay, the Sandstorm is doing damage. Well, I guess not to those first two. He's gonna be resistant to this. So I'm best off... So he's sending out a lichen rock. Let me back to East one. I feel like Mudshot was not super effective in one of these times. Is it just super weak? Is that what it is? It only does like 20 damage? Ugh, it's a fucking roar. Okay, now this is a... 
this is really the one that I did not want to come out. Unless magic will leave. Rock slide, shit. 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 God. Get in there. There. See, that's all we needed. Maybe, I don't know. Crunch is stronger, doesn't have the flinch capabilities, but it's fine. It's fine. I really need to get out of this damn cave. Sandstorms are weather too, you know. I swear they are. Fuck you! I just remembered, you killed one of my Pokemon. I know I killed a bunch of yours, but... Where is it? No damage. Alright, so... Man, I spent time teaching you one attack. Alright, I guess I need one of these Gimme Ghoul. But <sighs> none of these Pokemon are from this generation except Gimme Ghoul. And sadly, this one I forgot to name. So I guess I'm going with Scrooge. Did, did, um, did you have an item? No. No, I refuse to fight any more Pokemon between here and the Poke Center. I built up these muscles by many trips to the gym. My brilliant brawn will surely lead me to victory. I will rage all over this guy. A massive musculature misled me. Ah, fuck that machine. Give me something to cheer me up. Heal my stupid Pokemon. 30 minutes in, I just made it to the gym. Alright, now. 
who has moves that are good against ghosts? So, ghosts? I think it's psychic. So we need... Psychic is weak to go. Okay. Oh, well, in that case, I'll make him my my leader. If he spawns as a backup. I can't lose. <laughs> now, don't give me a stupid challenge. I am not in the mood for it. <sighs> Jock. Hello, hello, Yagabra. How goes your treasure hunt? Figured out what you're hunting for yet? Sure have. That's great. Look at you, knowing exactly what you're after. Many students choose to make the gym circuit a part of their treasure hunts. It's no easy feat, but even making the attempt is a worthwhile experience. That's why I was waiting here. Make sure you know your homeroom teacher's got your back. Hmm. I did not know you were my homeroom teacher. I guess I'm a bad... Lucky egg. It's an egg filled with happiness that earns the holder extra experience points. Oh, I need that. I hope you'll keep working on that Pokedex of yours too, since I did make the app and all. It's all for me. Just do your best and keep out of danger, okay? Right, give an item to hold. Alright, so now he needs a uh, lucky egg. Uh, I guess I'll save since I accidentally clicked that. I was actually going to see if I had anything I could give that one Pokemon. I guess nothing else. Welcome to the Alfornado Gym. They register you as a challenger. Your name is Jagerbra. Great, now in order to face gym leader Tulip, you'll need to first pass the gym test. Here at the Alfornado Gym, that means working up a sweat with a special kind of exercise. I'm talking about the emotional spectrum practice, created by Tulip herself, of course. Complete it and you pass the test. The woman wearing the black tracksuit in the practice area will explain the rules. Turn left after leaving the gym and you'll find the practice area right next door. Get out there and have fun. I am genuinely worried about this gym battle because the f it should be fine. But I'm worried that I'll get knocked out. Wait. Oh, Sue. Welcome, new kid. This is where we do emotional spectrum practice. Oh, wait. You're the one teacher. Why is your battle studies teacher here at a Pokemon gym working as an instructor, you ask? Well, I've been friends with the gym leader here, Tulip, since we were kids. We decided to have a Pokemon battle for a special rule. The loser has to do what the winner says. So we battled and, well... Look, never mind what happened. Point is, this is a chance to both get a workout in and help my friend when I don't have classes. Rules of Emotional Spectrum Practice, or ESP for short, are simple. I'll show you a certain movement and all you have to do is copy it. Ready to get this gym test started? I hope your body and mind are ready for the challenge. Hmm. Great, let's get to exercising. Show me an eruption of emotions. Take on ESP. Is this going to be like Dance Dance Revolution? Wait, 
Do I need to do it a bunch? Is this... Do I need to hold it? Guys, I'm really confused by this. Did I win? That was awesome. I can't stop grinning after witnessing such perfect power of expression. That's enough of a warm up. Now let's really put those muscles to work with a Pokemon battle. Gotta keep moving. This is no ordinary battle, this is a workout. Trainer Emily. Alright, she has a Gotharita. Gotharita. Okay, so the Gotharita is level 43, so I should be fine. Maybe I can get a few more levels out of this. Curlia. I guess it's fine. No, it, is it part... Okay, it's not fairy yet. Or it's fairy psychic. I guess fairies aren't super effective against ghost. I'm moved by how well you moved, both you and your Pokemon. you're getting tired but you've got to hang in there time to start the second half oh really but it, it was dumb It's like I did that one, right? Covered in sweat and overflowing with emotion. That was an impressive round. Don't give up yet. It's time for another battle. Hold out on that lactic acid. 
My goal is to grow strong and build muscle. Any tips? Sounds like gym trainer Raphael. It's an out rump egg. But if this one could make them flinch... Yeah, this guy's three Pokemon. Oh wait. If he's asleep... I need to use Hex. Does massive damage. Indeedy. I guess keep battling. I don't know what Indeedy is. Uh. Um. I guess just bite it. I don't know. None of these are what I would have expected to see from me. From psychic trainers. The opposing and DD Fainan. Alright, Metacham is psychic fighting. So dark won't work, but ghost should be fine. Nothing grows faster than a growing kid like you. I like that I am at least seeing new Pokemon. Good job, you made it all the way through the ESP. Passed this test, no doubt about it. Congrats. Not done yet. Spread over the lobby, staffer on the double. I have to report your passing grade formally finished. Alright, so I'm gonna go heal and then take on this gym. A nugget, sweet. All right, what's up? See, so you completed the ESP exercise. Congratulations! Now we're on the right to challenge the gym leader. You ready to challenge the gym leader? The bewitching beautician. Very well. Allow me to show you to the battle court. Trying to think. I know I've s saw the emblem, the little circle of the gym leader, but I can't think. She actually was. Suppose you're right. Okay, I'll get things moving here on my end. Let's keep the tagline simple, naturally beautiful. And order the new eyeshadow color too, would you? Thanks, you're a doll. Gotta run now. Chat with you later. I like how her dress has wings that move. Hello there. I'm Tulip, the gym leader here. But I must tell you that being a makeup artist is my main line of work. Dendra had nothing but praise for you. She said you totally slayed out there. <laughs> I must say you are a cute challenger. I'm sure my ESP exercise made you all the more beautiful. Doesn't that make you happy? You keep your Pokemon beautiful and clean as well. I see you have quite the aesthetic sense. 
Appearance is equally important for both people and Pokemon. Makeup is like magic. Anyone can use it to change their appearance. Allow me to put my skills to use to make your cute little Pokemon even more beautiful. Wait, are those little things Pokemon? You're quite a good base to test my makeup magic on. What shall I use on you? Um, oh! Instead of a giraffe rig, it's a far ig or raff. That's a confusing name. Alright. Bite it. I've heard it. Everything here is psychic. So one of these two is going to be... One of these two attacks will be super effective. Maybe both. I wish my regular attack was higher on him. Right? Yeah. I should start off with Hex, and if it go doesn't affect him. I wonder if my fire does more damage because it's a special. Pretty sure Will of the Wisps kind of sucks. Gardevoir. <sighs> Gardevoir is psychic and fairy. So if. Oh shit. I wanted to switch. Um... Hex should work. Sort of our psychic fairy. Yeah. Mm, this is gonna hurt. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, 120. Uh, heal me a good bit, but. Another Psychic Blast. Yeah, 55. 44, okay. So we are comparable. Good thing mine's faster. It's now Espar... Espatha? Espatha. ESP Hathra. What the fuck is that thing? I fought it bef one before. Alright, so that did 49 damage. About to send out Florgus. Is that the flower? You're just as hard to get rid of as caked on mascara, I see. Need a good makeup remover. I think when she does her thing, it's gonna lose its grass typing. Come here, my little Florgus. It's time for a makeover. You'll become a new you. Ah, shoot. It's not 
quite enough. My bewitching beauty methods will cleanse you right down to the depths of your pores. Please don't kill me. I can't lose a third. Oh, thank God. If I would have lost a third Pokemon in this episode, I think I'd have to quit. Oh shit, I did lose a third. Fuck. I forgot about Tropius. Oh. I'm gonna say no, but I'll look at it. I do need a. Mm, but it's. Uh, I would, but. I need damage dealing attacks. Your strength has a magic, so it cannot be washed away. I lost the battle, and your beauty rivals even my own? I can't believe it. You are quite splendid. Yes, truly amazing. Perhaps I should take you under my wing before you make your big break elsewhere. I suppose I need to work on myself a little more first before I run off and do such a thing. You've earned my gym badge. Allow me to strike one of my best poses to give it to you. Congratulations. Interesting. But, hey... That's another gym badge for me. With six gym badges, Pokemon of up to level 50 will be easier to catch and listen to the commands you give them. If you train hard, you'll be able to use this move in a totally perfect way. Psychic. Wonder who can learn it. Don't go uploading that selfie we just took to social media, okay? Why? I think my makeup has run a little while of all the moving and sweating I did during our battle. Oh, that makes sense. I need to fix it fast before my next appointment. My schedule is absolutely packed, you know. Farewell, then. You did splendidly today. I like the people that just cheer at, this, at nothing happening in the battle arena. Oh. Hassle. Different. <laughs> is this the third teacher we've seen here? Greetings once more. I was watching your battle with the gym leader from the sidelines. I must say, I thought it was simply excellent. Full marks, gold star, extra credit even. Hardly had you set out Skelligerg before you launched into your strategy. That unrelenting offensive, that flurry of attacks, what an official way to corner the opponent. You are an artfully trained Pokemon. Such a vibrant palette of moves. Ha, I do beg your pardon. Didn't mean to let my emotions run amok like that. Summary, simply wanted to say that you seem to have gotten even stronger. I must admit, I'm eager for you to gather all the badges. As a member of the Elite Four, I await the day you come to face me with great anticipation. Oh, but one thing. Don't let your studies fall by the wayside. Be sure to come to the Academy now and then. Yeah. There's definitely a lot of classes at the academy that I need to complete, but I am here, and we're at the end of this episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, let's see. So that we've completed 13 of our missions, so we have 5 left, which I'm guessing I'll probably do, like, I want to get that one done. But I'd like my Pokemon to be a little stronger because it seemed like they weren't strong enough just trying to get there. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Be sure to come back next time. As always, I will see you in the next episode. Bye bye!